How's it? Inglus. Welcome to Mongoose Max Hawaii. The Tim. Huh. Apparently, if I wear the headphones, I can hear myself talking to the microphone. Hmm. Da 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 Okay. How's it? It's on um, the 14th? Yes, it's March 14th. It's the Ides of March, I guess. And uh, tax time's coming up soon. In Toastmaster, I gave my speech, and our politically active uh, person gave me a hat, so now I can be cat in the hat. <laughs> and I found out, also found, and I also got that hat from there, too. I also found out that... Um, vis-a-vis uh, -vis talking to my dentist. I'm confused. Yeah, I was confused too. It's like I'm being fogged. How do you feel? How do I feel? I don't know. I feel okay, except a lot of stuff. They're going to bring cement out so I have to move my car in the morning. I mean, it's only been like four weeks since I was out of the hospital with an operation. I'm like, this is crazy freaking stop coming on. And, um, let's see, what else would I do? Oh, yeah, the dentist who said, hey, are you still doing your... <laughs> my doctor's always... My regular doctor asked me, and my dentist asked me, you still doing the, you, the channel thing, your vlog thing, or... Uh-huh, I'm still doing it. <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I, you know, I, I, I'm in I'm in that. I'm, in, I'm institutionalized by my own process. So anyhow, <clears throat> we figured out that politics, and I said, well, people don't like the politics, but they like, I don't know, crypto, movie reviews, things like that. So I'm probably going to try to uh, think of diversifying and just, I don't know, throw stuff up there. I think people find my videos, except for my kind of regular users, how's it? Uh, regular video, regular viewers, yay! But uh, I think people might find stuff with search. So, you know, if I just find the most popular thing happening in the news, but I can't be clickbait. I don't want to be clickbait. So, anyways, there it goes, like that. Okay. So I guess that's the vlog, except the weather's changing. Yay. Oh, gosh, finally, that wind is driving me crazy. I'm just an irritated bag of grumbly fur. But um, I'm working on it. I'm happy. So um, in the news, uh, well, um, politically, they got Trump. He's just banging on those trials, and they're banging back. And his outlook isn't looking good, but I don't know if it's going to basically affect his um, election campaign for the Republicans. It's just mind-boggling this uh, moment in U.S. history with this stuff going on. I mean, the guy wants to be a dictator and suppress the free press and and be, um, you know, uh, have the courts in his control. No three separation of powers and balance, checks and balances. None of all that's in constitutional, oh, we don't need that. Just throw it out the window. It's just like throwing everything that makes America, America, as far as a structure. And pretty soon, it's going to be vote, vote only for him. And and ah, and he's grifting all that. Stuff. It's like, what the bloody hell, you know? So, um, uh, yeah. So, um, 
uh, I'm stumped why there's so much support. I guess it's money. I mean, blind cult of personality plus money. I don't know what it is. Anyways, there's that. And then there is um, what's in the news basically is the president Netanyahu of Israel. He's Israel's president, and they're democratic. And Israel's been a ally of America since I don't know time immemorial because they have the Old Testament, the New Testament, <laughs> the Bible. Bible Belt, you gotta have Jerusalem on our side, crusade. So uh, Netanyahu is not looked favorably about what he's doing currently and sort of his um, way of operation uh, generally in Israel. He's not like, he's just been in there too long kind of thing. And since they're a democratic country and a major ally of US and are I in want one. this time of crisis because Arab nations are basically attacking using their proxy groups from all over the place. What it put Israel off the map and they're trying to counter war on their jihad terrorists. I told him. And they're going, oh, the innocent civilians. <coughs> it's genocide. So all this stuff counts against Netanyahu and he's up for the election. Everyone wants to meddle in the democratic election of Israel to get Netanyahu off off the seat, you know. Iron. And <laughs> iron? And and um, even the politicians here in the U.S. are getting, of course, getting on board. If they're railing against us, queuing on a pump of GOPers nice. and our, uh, you know, cult leader, if they're railing against us, meddling in our, well, I don't see why they should be uh, it's counterintuitive. It's uh, hypocritical that they're doing this with the net. Yeah, this is. So it's all just crazy. I think Netanyahu's kind of been stuck in there because, um... Am I dead? Well, am I dead? I don't know. Grandfather. <laughs> Grandfather, the ghost box is just going off. I mean, ghost dude. Uh, I think Netanyahu's been in there since... I mean, he's been buddies with, like, Reagan and stuff. He goes way back. And, um... Their parliamentarian judicial system kind of has the same kind of troubles as ours when it... It's like quest of power instead of balance of sanity. Blah, blah, blah. Anyways, let's see what's in the... Uh, uh, let's try not to make too much. Okay, let's see what's in Hawaii news, yeah? Oh my gosh, Hawaii. Oh, the house okayed $1 billion in fire expenses because we're all so afraid we'd go burn down like Maui. What if it happens to Honolulu? Let's put up a billion dollars worth of smoke detectors. The guy, crazy, killed his family and himself um, it's like a memorial and they're just like going I too and I mean like he was supposedly a nice guy he was just like really in debt but they could have sold the house they're in pro and it's like why did he snap is that whole like it's just like the shining you know like ooh. Uh, the, uh, yeah it's like uh, the evil calls so it's just like one of those bizarre things he, he freaking snapped. Okay, in the sports, ah, the, the coach of the UH of volleyball guys is like five weeks to figure it out because it's like, what? Okay, they're number one ranked and their star player, Spiros Hakas, is out for the count. I mean, the poor guy got a knee injury and he can no longer play, period. I mean, he's just like out of volleyball as far as you know, but being the star player, he can't do that. So it's like the whole team is like, oh, oh, and that's where they're at. I'm like, that's kind of sad. It happened to a friend of mine, like I said before. Ah, and then there's that. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not following that. Woo. Oh wait, see, there's a pizza. Oh, see, you're just trying to figure out. Okay, no, who's that's the Spyros guy thing right there. He's like, he got. Uh, he's like, he's the guy that made the faces too. Like, hey, snarl at you. Arr, I'm gonna spike this one. Arr. It was cool. I'm like, oh shoot, man. You know, just, just relax. It's, it's like just, just so much stuff. Remember back in the day, like 1968, and you don't want to just relax. And it's like, hey, man, I'll just put the surfboard on top of the um, what? <laughs> this the 50, 50 Chevy. Uh, Robert Campbell specializes in the technical theater at UH hopes to 
some they find designing, building, and lighting and theatrical designs, but he figured out as long as a surf stays up at Diamond Head, I I do stage design and I am theatrical sets. I am able to bake a surf rack. See, <laughs> it's got a long board. Oh gosh, Diamond Head. All right, you know what? Maybe back in the day here. Not back in the day. We just did back in the day. Political cartoon. Oh, oh my gosh. Entitlements will be cut. Social Security, Medicare. They're out there. To... Oh, people on Medicare and Social Security, they're like, they're just gonna... I can't believe they're talking about cutting that stuff. It's like kind of a bedrock. You know, out goes Roe versus Wade, out goes Social Security. What are they doing? Are they amassing money for themselves? If the money's supposed to be for American people, it's new. Mm -hmm. Anyways, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. continuing on, we got cannabis is illegal. Pharmaceuticals aren't. B -b 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 -b. And the support for Israel's where B B B B. Let's look at uh, Skyline. Yeah, the ra that's what they call the rail. Skyline. <laughs> Skynet. <laughs> Here we I go. I want one. I want one. You want a Skynet too? Extend Skyline's route to increase ridership. A novel idea for increasing rail ridership is to expand rail routes. Rails route. Use new ideas to spark more rail ridership site article January 31st. Extending rail to the University of Hawaii Manoa would blunt the seasonal traffic effects at the university and give students one less stress while attending their studies. Extending the originally proposed Waikiki route would get tourists off our roads and give them an option to go straight from the airport to their hotel where they belong. <laughs> Extensions. Who to, is she? Sorry. <laughs> Extensions to Kapule would allow for future development that would have less of an impact on current congestion. Even further, extensions to YNI would benefit entire population. All of this while encouraging developments that give our mainland diaspora something to come home to. Expand the rail now. Nathan Anderson, Kalaheo, Kauai. Oh, thank you, Nathan. Thank you, Nathan. You're in, Kala you're in Kauai thinking about all this stuff, eh? Diaspora, oh, that's a big word. Okay. Diaspora is like, you know, like, you know, like, um, the Babylonian exile sure. of the Jewish nation under the Persian Empire. They, well, that's when people disperse into other land and then come home to the motherland. Diaspora is when they're all dispersed. So, people that live in Hawaii in the mainland are the Mainland, our, 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 our Kama Aina diaspora. <laughs> oh my gosh. But, you know, congestion from Kapule and Wainai, which is way out west, congestion from there into town, Honolulu and Waikiki, is bad. That's a, that's some huge congestion. I thought, man, at least oh. that would help. And tourists can go from the airport to Waikiki and back easy. That would be good. Yeah. So, um, yeah, the skyline, I mean, it could be used, useful. I don't know. Anyways, what am I fooling? It's, it's, uh, anyways, it's, uh, 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 go, go over here. Where, where am I? Okay. It's time for this one, this one here. Okay, aloha, aloha now. It's it's um getting sunnier. That's a windy one. Aloha, aloha to you. Happy day.